Rain must have really been on to something if all these people are after him. Crane! Come out, come out, wherever you are! You crane... This it? Thought you were some kind of big shot. So, rumor is you've got information our boss wants. You tell me where this treasure is, and he's willing to leave you alone. Scout's honor. Where we're camped? <laughs> okay, it's... No. Why don't you go first? You think we're idiots? The only thing in 76 are a bunch of wimpy, soft-shelled rich kids that got to nap away the apocalypse. Now, start flapping. Or things are gonna get messy. No, you first. No, you first! No, you first! No, tell me what I want to know. Okay, fine. We're at the West Virginia Lumber Company, okay? There. Now tell me where the hell the treasure is. So that's how you want to do it, huh? Suit yourself! Well, you don't look too worse for wear. You managed to figure out where those miscreants are hiding? Fantastic. So that's where their boss will be. You just need to... Wait, wait West Virginia lumber? Wait, that is not right. You misheard them for sure. And that's of concern. Why, exactly? Was wandering up that way not too far back. The lumber company? That place was overrun with a bunch of those big green bastards. Mutants. You've seen those Frankensteins. If this gang was able to clean those things out of the mill, Duchess, these guys might be tougher than advertised. Hmm. You got any recommendations on how you'd proceed? 
but I wouldn't go in guns blazing, unless you got some big guns. Could try and luck your way inside, maybe see if they want to talk to you. But there was this family I ran into up that way that I'm sure has had to deal with them already. There was also this, uh, let's say, special scrapper who was making some pretty bold claims about his knowledge of the mill. Wouldn't be a bad idea to check in with either of them. You'll find them at Anchor Farm, if these thugs haven't already run them off. But if they are still there, well, they probably managed to work something out with them. Hey, it couldn't hurt to find out what it was. Found him living in the stalls at Tyler County Fairground. Guy kept claiming he knew the best way to run the mutants out of the mill. But, listen, I couldn't get him this bill, Hal. Probably have a better chance he'll share what he learned with someone who still has an entire face. Well, that's a good thing, because that's all I've got. If you haven't already explored up that way, the fastest route back would be via Vault 76 and trekking north from there. And take care of yourself, all right? You're doing us a big one here. Plenty of unclaimed space up the road. West Virginia, lo no, don't know anything about them. Now I'd like you to leave. I'm sure what I know is none of your business. Now, how about you take a hike? Trying to let you know you're trespassing. Free to leave whenever you like. Bye. you with protection, and you help feed the many, many mouths I have in my camp. You mean you get to take whatever you want and leave us all to starve? It won't come to that. I'll see to it personally. Now, do we have a deal? You can take your deal and shove it. We're not your slaves. Password to get inside is blue 
Rob me with jokes on you. <clears throat> Don't get nothing. Back, huh? Well, still got nothing for you to take. Ah, you talked to the well done guy, huh? Well, yeah, I got a little trick up my sleeve. Could kill them all if I wanted. But I'm not just giving it away. You gotta get me something. Island nearby's got a big nest in it. Bring me an egg? I'll give you what I got. Something nasty enough that I don't want to do it? Up to you, though. Something nasty enough. Government-issued astral transporter. Snagged it on my way out of the lab. It takes your physical form and drop. Makes you nearly invisible! Makes it a whole lot easier to take. Mind the locals out there.
find me my egg? Well, hello. That is a beauty. When you're hatched, you're gonna call me Papa. Here, those are my end of the bargain. Make the most of them. Father, someone else. Those mutant things that were here before thought they were tough stuff. Almost kind of sad. No one's heard from Batter. Suspects he finally managed to get himself killed. <laughs> Batter was a long shot anyway. I always figured it'd take someone coloring with a full box of crayons to find us our... <sighs> you the one with the password? Presume someone gave it to you because they thought you could be useful. Name's Roper. Now, explain to me why the hell you're taking up my air. Is that so? And why exactly would I do that? Sure you are. But if you know where your treasure is, well, then I'm all ears. Damn right you will. But I'm a generous man. You bring me the location first, you'll get your fair share. Now get out. My people shouldn't bother you while you're doing this for us. So long as you don't bother them. You're back. You managed to get those punks out of our hair yet? Oh, is that all? <laughs> I guess I should have specified how I would have liked this to be resolved. I suppose it's on both our heads to find this treasure then. But you did good. Shows maybe you could be trusted. Maybe. But there's still the issue of my missing muscle. They went out chasing some unsavory characters. Never came back. They're two of the tougher cookies I've met in my day. So them being gone this long means something happened. You track them down? Maybe I remember a thing or two about this crane fella. Music to my ears. 
Missing person number one's named Polly. Got a transmitter in her. You could track her with your little radio there. Missing person number two goes by Saul. Those two are closer than toes and bad stilettos. So if you find one, the other's likely close by. Find them for me, and I'll pay you for the privilege of getting to yell at them in person. Appreciate it. Polly's tracking frequency is 99.7. The once proud home of Appalachia's smooth jazz. I figured someone should get some use out of it. Find out what happened to him. If I need to find new people, I'd like to at least ensure I tried to do right by the old ones. <laughs>